Hi friends, it's Sejal again. I wanted to show you some ball exercising for your back today. So I'm gonna show you a couple of the ball exercising. Once you settle on your ball nicely, <clears throat> just make sure your uh, nice the ball is nicely steady on the ground. Just control and balance, relax yourself, keep the ball straight, both arms down in the back, giving a good stretch. Make sure your legs are nicely steady. Relax, keeping the both arms nicely on the ground, giving a good stretch to your internal system. Hold it for a few seconds. See how much your internal system is nicely stretched by doing this, and it's safe as well. You're using the ball to stretch your muscles, stretching the internal system, strengthening the bones, and circulating the blood nicely. Then the other one you can do is keeping the one arm on the on the back, in the back, and one arm, I mean one leg straight. So, and then form it to your right hand, right, right foot is folded, left leg is straight, along with your right arm is stretched nicely. So opposite arms are nicely stretched with the opposite arms, opposite leg. And the other arm is on the ground, giving a good stretch to your opposite arms and opposite leg. Hold it for a few seconds and shift. Try with the opposite leg this time with your opposite arm. Very good. Relax your muscles, giving a good stretch and release. Very good. The other one you can do is holding the both arms nicely straight next to your legs. Okay, make sure your legs are nicely stretched. Keeping the head up. This is basically structure straightening. You're straightening your body structure. And release. Very good. You can also keep your both arms <clears throat> nicely on the top and lean to the right in the middle and lean to the left 20 times okay this really helps you um, strengthen your shoulder muscles it releases you from the shoulder from the frozen shoulders okay it helps you release frozen shoulder issues it also exercises the arms nicely so anywhere from 10 times to 25 is good um, next one I want to show you is Keeping the both arms nice on the ground, keeping the ball steady, one, one leg up on the top of the ball, and you're gonna shift it to the other ball, I mean, shift it to the other leg on top of the ball, giving a good stretch. This, this way you're increasing the stamina. It also helps support your wrist muscles, strengthening your wrist muscles your back, straightening your back, spinal cord muscles. It also strengthens your hip muscles, your thigh muscles, your shoulder muscles. Shift to the elbows. You wanna make sure you turn to your elbows, giving a nice stretch. Keeping the legs same on, the, on top of the ball. Very good, you want to make sure you hold it for a few seconds and then shift it. Keep your both arms nicely on the in front of the ball. Keep the ball in the middle, giving a good relaxation to your internal system on top of the ball while you do the stretches on your back and your legs. Now you're gonna lift your right leg up 20 times, swing it back and forth while you look at the ceiling, giving a good stretch to your throat muscles, shift your sides. You wanna make sure you do at least 20, start with the 10 first if you're a beginner, okay? And then you can keep both of your arms, elbows nicely on the ball, giving a good stretch. You can do it this way, giving a good stretch on your back. You can also lift up your legs. Very good. This using the ball, I like to use the ball because it's very safe and you can still do the exercises efficiently for your back. Thank you for watching.
by now. If you like this channel, if you like to watch more of the videos, you can always uh, subscribe to our channels and videos so you can get uh, more notifications every time when I post a good videos for you. Thanks.